Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you this, uh, Brinks, uh, Metal Halide, and, uh, you can also put Mercury Vapor Bulbs in this fixture, which was damaged during a strong storm that came through about a week ago. It blew the pole over, we'll take a look at it right here, it busted the whole side of the lens out right there. And it broke the uh, outer glass of the mercury vapor bulb I had in there, 100 watt. You can see the uh, arc tube there. This was one of my favorite lights. I hate that it was blown over and broken. We'll take a look at the mounting plate. It's all good on this side. But the side that it hit the ground on, it just broke it right off. What is that? A little spider on it. Here's this side of it. It bent all the reflector right there. Whatever you want to call it. You might can't tell on camera. But right there, there's a huge dent in this heavy-duty uh, housing, which it hit the ground extremely hard. Yeah, I hate this thing was blown over. I have the pole put back up now. I have a Cooper lighting, uh, 70 watt high pressure sodium light up there now. And I just got this thing not a couple months ago, put it up. It was an excellent light. It did not make any noise whatsoever. And then it blew over and shattered everywhere. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Uh, this, these marks right here, that's, I had a coated mercury vapor bulb in there, and that's the phosphor coating. Probably got some on my fingers. can see it right there. And uh, we'll step out there and look at the high pressure sodium light. This part right here is lit up by that mercury vapor light. You can see it is right there. I had the pole put together in two parts and when it blew over it broke it in two so I Put bolts in it and put it back together. <coughs> See, it's lighting up all this out here. You can, I don't know if you can hear it on camera, but it is humming a little bit. And right here is where I put it back together. I just put it up <coughs> last night so it still has the dirt around it. Lining up the cotton fields out there. All those other mercury vapor lights everywhere else. This is the only high pressure sodium light I have put up. And again, it is made by Cooper Lighting.
70 watts. Very good quality light. Well, this was a look at my broken Brinks 100 watt metal halide and you can also put mercury vapor bulbs in metal halide fixtures and this new uh, Cooper lighting <coughs> 70 watt high pressure sodium light. Thank you very much for watching.